uh, peace of Christ to all uh, this video you know I don't know it's kind of boring huh are we still talking about the same topic about the rips uh, sorry for that guys I don't want to make the video but this guy he made another video and I will make you uh, listen to it I did make a video a while back about Surah 86 verses 5 to 7 and I believe one of Christian Prince's minions found the content unsettling al Taraibi has often been generally translated as ribs as the expression denotes arched bones According to Imam Razi in one of his works, he stressed that the first use, the very first use of this expression al taraib was in reference to the female anatomy. So there has to be something okay. Before we continue, I want you to be careful of what you heard. He said al razi He said al razi the explanation of al razi Okay? I want you to take this note down first. Arazi. This is from his mouth. So his reference that a taraib is just an arch of bone. It is from the book. It's called the book of Arazi explaining the Quran. The Imam of Arazi. An expression used in Surah 86 verse 7, al taraibi has often been generally translated as ribs, as the expression denotes arched bones. According to Imam Razi in one of his works, he stressed that the first use, the very first use of this expression al taraib was in reference to the female anatomy. So there has to be something peculiar to the female anatomy or to the female reproductive system that is encased by this al taraib Let us look at the anatomical structure of the chest. If this word was supposed to be uh, supposed to be translated as chest, let us look at the organs encased by the chest. I'm not going to continue his video. You can watch it because he's just trying to explain what he, you know, he based his video in, which is that Al Imam Al Razi he said that it is an arch of, uh, you know, of bones, and this is have to do with the female. That's what he said. It's something, ha you know, it exists only for the female, and he will go down and he will show you that this is in the butt of the women, not in the chest. Okay, you can watch the video by yourself and you will laugh. Now, I will take you to the Arazi book just to show you how low class the Muslims when they lie. I'm not calling you names. I'm not calling you name. But you are a low class person. You just said the Imam Arazi, one of his work, he, he have one book to explain that verse. And I will show everyone the book. And I will show you what he said about this verse exactly, exposing your lies. Arazi never said any word of what you said. Let us see the book and we will laugh together. And I will post <laughs> the link of Arazi next to it so people they can even the one who don't speak English he can go to Google he can post the link and they can see what I'm talking about. And he tried to fool you he say the Imam Arazi did you so, show, did you show them the, the Arazi what he's saying? I challenge you to show us. Make a video like mine Pause the link of the book of Arazi. I challenge you. Now let us go and see what Arazi is saying. And actually, Arazi is more fool than all Muslims because, according to Arazi, he is saying the following. Now, guys, this is the book he chose. He said Arazi, he's a scholar, the one he approved. I will show you in a second that he is a liar. And again, I challenge him to make another video and to post to us the book of Arazi which I am showing you and I'm going to post it next to it he did not do it in his video because he have no proof he is just making things up like you know if I want to say uh, like just to, to cover my back I say you know Ibn Kathir said but can you show it to me from Ibn Kathir this is what he did just to cover his back because now he have he have to make something you know he cannot say I am saying that he have to give us a scholar and the scholar his name is Arazi we heard it and now this is Arazi, and this is the explanation of the Quran he have, and we will go down and we will show you. First, in here, I want to say to him, thank you for mentioning Arazi, because as long as you approve it, let us laugh together at your scholar. You cannot now say he did not say that. I challenge you to say he did not say it. He is saying that all the sperm, listen to this guys carefully, all the sperm, they are generated in the brain. 
here we go forget about the balls forget about anything the sperm is coming from the brain they want to fix it they destroy it you see the Muslims they try to defend Islam the generator the genera generator sorry of, of the of uh, of the many which means the sperm is a dimag and this is where the generation happened and he sent it down through the nerves of the dimag which means the brain in very very narrow uh, 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 nerves to all to all over of the body man even your sperm go to your hand okay no wonder you know people these days they are sweating sperm and he's saying too and the proof of what he is saying listen to this carefully guys that the sperm grow in that in the brain that the sperm itself look like the brain the sperm look exactly like the brain that's it this is his imam this is harazi you know come on the sper the balls of the man or the balls of the women i don't know he's talking about now he's talking about the man by the way now not about the women the, 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 you know we were talking about the backbone remember the backbone right we discover in Arazi that the backbone it is the bone in the brain in the top this is where the brain is this is the backbone and the brain is the one is making the sperm and now he cannot say no I don't accept Arazi he just mentioned his name so according to him and not only that he's saying and the proof of what I am saying of his explanation that the sperm look like the brain if we talk without proof Muslims will say a liar when we talk with the proof we got a funny answers we will go to Google you know Google translation we will post and we will get the following brain and evidence that the picture resembled the brain so the sperm they resemble the brain amazing don't tell me you don't like this discovery and I will show you guys how you can find exactly what I'm talking about you know when you open this page you will see those numbers I don't know if they, if they will look for you fine and when you open the page it is 45016 for you just remember the image okay it is almost as you see at the end of the page just measure about an inch and a half and go up you will see this then you copy count line you know you can count the lines and you copy them and you see by yourself or you can translate whatever you want and in here you will see the following about the word taraib because now our argument about the word taraib right let us see what the word taraib mean and you will see how we can expose the lies a taraib according to mr arazi we go up in the page we will see the word taraib here He's saying the taraib of the women is the chest bones where the necklace stay. You see how we can expose you? He was trying to make the word taraib in the butt of the women. This is the scholar he chose, and this is what he said. translate this is a translation it says cord women chest bones wear necklace so the taraib is not only the chest you know the, uh, this is what the translation saying read with me cord women chest bones wear necklace funny translation but enough for us so it is the chest you know bones and not only that it is the upper side of the chest where the necklace stay in his video he made that location in the butt of the women and he said a Razi said that look what the Razi is saying liars and not only that if you go to all those books in the front of our eyes all of them they are Islamic scholars at Tabari do you see the numbers in there all of them they are saying at Taraib is the breast is the chest story all of them Jamu al Bayan, Jamu al Bayan, Jamu al Bayan. This is the name of the book, Al Tabari. All of them they are saying that those, those is a location of the breast. You see it? I did expose you, 
and next time shame on you to lie the ribs of the women is not her butt Jesus is Lord and Muslims are liars as always and we prove that I mean